tradition for Lincoln Trail Elementary to celebrate on Veterans Day and I'm reminded each year of what a special tradition this holds and learning opportunity for our children with every new group of kindergarten students that come in and they begin to practice and become aware of what this means uh, my heart is always warm when I hear the, the, the youngest of our learners talking about what they know about the different branches of the military, what they know about veterans, who they know who are veterans. And so it's especially important for us to stop and pause and, and make special the learning opportunity that happens with Veterans Day. It's easy for us to recognize our veterans as active duty servicemen and servicewomen. They're visible 
um, with their uniforms. We recognize the uniforms. However, the majority of our veterans that we honor today no longer actively serve wearing a military uniform. Many have gone on to become our police officers, our firemen, our neighbors, and, and our teachers. Where the, whether they wear a military uniform today or wore it decades ago, veterans represent an unwavering dedication and an exemplify the highest ideals of service to our country. At this time, I would like to introduce our fifth grade pledge leaders and ask them to come to the flag. We will, um, when they are in place, then we will all stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing for the national anthem. Uh, please, please join us, Ellie Smith, Brady Begley, Maddie Tab, Lily Marlowe, Davis Lutz. one of the songs you will hear today as we honor you. Today we are honoring you as veterans. Veterans Day used to be called Armistice Day. It was to honor those who were a part of World War I. However, we later had many other events like World War II and the Korean War. Armistice Day was later renamed Veterans Day to honor all those who have served. Veterans, we are here to honor what Veterans, we are here today to honor you because of the sacrifices you have made. You have always been there for your country, your comrades, and to protect our freedom. One reason you, that you deserve to be honored here today is because of your willingness to sacrifice your lives for us. You don't even know us or our names. There is no greater show of patriotism than to enlist in the armed forces. As enlisted men and women, you face many days of uncertainty. You leave your lives here at home so that you can protect us without always knowing when you will return. 
When asked to go, you ask without question and without hesitation. It takes bravery and courage to go and serve our country. For your strength and determination, we are thankful. Today, we want to, you to know that we are grateful for your willingness to serve and sacrifice. Another reason that you veterans deserve to be honored is the way that you are always there for others. We know that you each have families of your own that you love and want to protect. However, when you go off to serve, you create another family. Your comrades are people you meet and protect and connect to without question. Your bond is inspiring the way that you stand with each other to accomplish a goal is incredible. While your families may be very far away, you know that they can always de depend on them for love and support. You also know that you can depend in many of the same ways on your comrades. I couldn't imagine what it would be like not to see the faces of my loved ones every day. But you do it without question and create a bigger family. Thank you for being men and women we can depend on and trust to stand together. The final reason why Veterans Day should be celebrated is you guys protect our freedom. Back hundreds of years ago during the Revolutionary War, our ancestors we're fighting for our freedom to live in this great land. And now we are still celebrating this freedom. If not for those brave soldiers who fought, America wouldn't be where it is today. You veterans are the reason we are a strong and beat country to this day. The things our soldiers had to witness is just proof of their courage and bravery. So many of you had to do and see things no one else would ever want to do. Some gave the ultimate sacrifices, their wives, their wives. Others like you here today were willing to make that sacrifice if it ever had to come to that. We are thankful you are here with us to carry on the legacy of the noble work you did. Now I just want to give the biggest thank you ever to all the veterans who have answered the call to duty, whether it was in time of peace or time of war. You are willing, and now this generation thanks you all for all you have done for us to preserve our freedom.
awesome. Thanks so much. Thank you, Ms. Harris, for leading all the different grade levels on their musical expressions. Uh, we thank you and honor you guests again for being here this morning. This concludes our Veterans Day celebration with the students. We are going to invite our veterans to stick around, socialize a bit in the cafeteria for a few moments. And students, you did a great job. Very proud of your, your heartfelt efforts that went into this this morning. Thank you so much.